As students at the University of Exeter, we've had so many opportunities to learn about primate behaviour, ecology and conservation. These opportunities have included talk marches about primates, a trip to the local monkey sanctuary in Cornwall, international field courses and research expeditions. For my final year research project, I was really lucky to have the opportunity to go out to Borneo and conduct biodiversity surveys with the Borneo Nature Foundation. As part of this research, we conducted a range of primate surveys, including orangutan nest counts, gibbon triangulation surveys, camera trapping and acoustic monitoring of orangutans. During one of the acoustic surveys, I had one of the most exciting experiences of my life. A stunning flange male orangutan appeared right in front of me out of nowhere. This was especially amazing because primates aren't habituated to humans in that area, so it was a completely unexpected encounter. In the final year of my undergraduate degree in zoology, I was lucky enough to go on an incredible field course to India. Based in the southern state of Karnataka, we saw so much incredible and diverse wildlife. Although the tigers were a highlight for many students, for me a real treat was the presence of so many different primate species. We were able to compare the social behaviours and interactions of the macaques to the langurs and see the differences between them. As someone interested in behavioural ecology, it was a real treat and an amazing interaction. The macaques were particularly really mischievous and would constantly interact with us at camp, an absolute highlight of the course. For my final year field course, I went to Costa Rica, which was a fantastic experience and we had some amazing encounters with primates. I was particularly in awe of the howler monkeys as they made incredibly loud howls which travelled through the rainforest in the early morning, acting as nature's alarm clock. Even though you could often hear them before you could see them, it was a really special moment when we spotted them sitting around in the treetops above us, and if we were extra lucky, we saw their babies hanging onto them. In the summer between second and third year, a group of students and I were able to travel to Borneo to collect data for our final year research project. We saw loads of incredible wildlife, but a highlight for me was definitely seeing these gibbons. Another student and I had left camp with the primatologist at around 4am. We hiked until we heard movement in the canopy and froze. Above us were two gibbons, blissfully unaware of our presence, swinging through the trees performing the great call. We just stood there, listening, completely in awe. It was truly unforgettable. During my final year field course in South Africa, we observed an incredible range of flora and fauna, but none with quite as much personality as the baboons. It was fascinating to sit and watch them moving through our camp, interacting with each other and seeing what they could find. Um, but needless to say, if you left any bit of food unguarded, it wouldn't last long. Uh, and we lost quite a few bananas on that trip. In my final year, I signed up to trek to Everest Base Camp in Nepal through the university's Raise and Donate team. After the trek, we visited Swayam Banat in Kathmandu, which is a Buddhist temple also known as the Monkey Temple. It was amazing to see these rhesus macaques so close up and it topped off what was already an incredible trip. During my time at the University of Exeter, I was fortunate enough to visit Borneo and Costa Rica where I gained valuable insight into the ecology, evolution and diversity of primates. Some of my fondest memories are from these trips, including watching gibbons sing in the early mornings and being surrounded by an angry troop of pigtailed macaques. However, the most touching of all these experiences was a five minute stare off with a wild, habituated orangutan that hung from a low branch about three metres away from me. That moment always reminds me of the curious nature of other primates and how important it is that we study and protect them. <laughs>